Hi guys, and welcome back to the Knocker Gamer. Whoa, okay, I uh, didn't realise that was going to happen. Uh, it's just all the weekly updates have just started again. Um, so we are back in with Assassin's Creed. We're picking back up where we left off and we are attacking this military camp. Now, I've just done this camp in my home game, so I know like what to do basically. And I know where shit is um, and how many people there are. Not incredibly how many people there are, but near enough. Um, and I did do this quite stealthily before. Uh, I know there's a couple of guards over there, but I can't see them yet. Maybe I need to get lower. Like that. Uh, there should be. Right there. And then there should be. Yeah. And there should be a couple of guards there. Yeah. There should be some round here. I don't know where he is, though. Ah, oh, there he is. And then there should be one around here. Up oh, there, there they are. Do, 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 do. Okay, I think that's probably them all. So, yeah, uh, I did this quite stealthily before, uh, and I'm hoping to do it again. So I'm gonna get my predator bow out. I've upgraded a lot of stuff, like I said before, in my old in the, not my old episode in the last episode. So I've upgraded a lot of these as well. So my range is incredibly good. My braces are getting there, but it's hard to find pelts. Um, apart from buying them and stuff. I've got tools as well. I've figured out a really cool way of uh, killing flackertees, which I'll talk about while I'm doing this um, doing this camp. So basically I struggled on for ages and ages trying to trying to kill flackertees because I thought, what th what's a really cool way of trying to get some really cool gear um, and um, like trying to do it the easiest way. So basically, uh, yeah, like I tried and tried and tried and I kept on dying and I kept on wondering why because I was like level... 25 and the flackety was like level 20 yet he, could, he was still killing me so then i decided with my new skill points to get um sleeping darts i'd start getting tools and i figured out that if you hit them with a sleeping dart they don't go to sleep but it does daze them for a couple of minutes which gives you enough time to do like a, a charged heavy attack and that if you do it with i, I did it with dual blades or if you do it with a fast blade, you'll knock them down to the ground and it gives you a bit more time to get like your overpowered attack. So basically, uh, it was like a, not like a foolproof way, because I did die a few times, but it's a better way of like, um, like killing the flakities. Can I get in there? No, I can't. Oh shit, get that. I'm sure I can get in there. Yes, I can. I could have gone really bad. Um,. So some of the other things that I've done. Uh, I've also done um, a few of the papyruses as well. Oh, where did he go? Oh, is he up there? No, he's not. Uh, I did a few of the papyruses, so I've only got one left, which is just basically just a place that I haven't been to yet. Um, and you just get a bunch of kill cool gear, so I've got like... Um, I'm my ammo spawn. Uh, I've got like a cool... Um, uh, I'm trying to think... What's the word I'm looking for? Bow. That's what I'm looking for. Bow. Uh, so yeah. Right. I'd recommend doing this camp at night because obviously a lot of the guards sleep and it makes it a fucking shit ton easier. So I can like kill that guy. Happy days. He's done. Dealt with. And then there is a couple of guards further over here. Now I'm sure there's one around here. Yeah, there they are. Couldn't see him before. And because it's at night time and they're asleep, I can sneak in and kill the bastards. That is. Look at that. Didn't feel anything. Well, they felt the knife, but. Oh, did I get. Yeah, I did. I was just checking to make sure I got the loot. So basically, you just need to um, work your way through this camp. It, If you. Like running all guns blazing, as as it were, uh, you won't get anywhere because there's there's literally too many of them. And I'm sure there's a yeah there is there's a the like a a fire point thing so they'll just call for backup and when backup comes, believe me from experience, backup doesn't half come. Uh, it really does. 
um, make it a lot harder. Right, I reckon I can fucking take him out. Mm, I might need a cleaner shot. Right over there. There we go. Hopefully he didn't, yeah, he didn't wake up, that's fine. So if you can get around here, that's the captain. You just need to kill the captain. Hello. No, die, 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 die. Oh, shit. There you go. Told you. Sword's awesome. Sword is awesome. Right, okay. So he's down. Um, I'm sure there was a bit of... Oh, yeah, there's that. Bit of loot. Um, right, there's three guards left. Right, there's one. Is there any more over here? Yeah, um, so with like all the synchronized points that I've got as well, Senyu's perception's really cool, really, really cool, really good. Right, so he's down. So, oh, you see me? I'll tell you what, I might try and just take him out. Yeah, boy! Okay, he's down. I may as well take him out. So, oh, shit, that went wrong. <laughs> Whoops. Fuck! There we go, that's what I wanted. Oh shit, I missed! Bollocks! Go on, turn the corner, turn the corner, turn the corner, turn the corner, turn the corner. There we go. Is he dead? Shit, he's not dead. I tend to piss this. Oh, he's on fire though. Tell you what, we'll try and get him again. There we go! Down. That's all the guards taken care of. So... Still and stay quiet. I don't need to. I will get you out of here. Oh shit, I didn't mean to put him down. Pick him up. Pick him up. There we go. Oh, fucking carry me, little shit. Bloody games never do what I tell them to do. Right. Okay. Do, do, do. See? We're already cracking on with the story. I don't know what he's about to do with the story, but we're still cracking on with it. Right. And. As soon as we are free and safe, where's my, where's my chocobo? Oh shit, I don't know where my chocobo is. Oh, well. I don't know where my, my camel was. Gods, thank you. Did Hotepre send you? No, but I must find him. I need his help to find the crocodile. Will you help me? Hotepre took a trade ship. He should be. It has a large statue on board. Oh my god, just go back to Lake Moria. Crocodile has hired mercenaries to find him. Then I must hurry. Get somewhere safe. Be well. Right. So now. Oh, is he over there? Is this Lake Moria? No. Ah, oh, I don't know. Oh well. Right. Uh, so we need a ship. Uh, I think there's one here. How convenient is that? So convenient. Okay. Yeah, this dude is. Uh, I think he was like the Egyptian ruler of this, of like this land sort of thing. But um, he's under a attack basically. Ah, oh, no, it's that one. There we go. There we go. Yeah, so I'm so happy to be back in Assassin's Creed. I don't know why it, it it's so relaxing to just play. Like, there's no. It's probably because I've been playing a lot of Assassin's uh, uh, Alien Isolation, and that shit's just stressful as fuck. A little bit closer. Yep, no, nah, fuck it. We're, we're in. There we go. Hey! Moving on. Some dialogue. So, now they send the son of Egypt against me. It has been a long time since I spilled so much blood. I was sent by Apollodorus. Uh, we share a common interest. Who are you? And what do you want, eh? I'm Bayako Siwa, and I seek information on the crocodile. The phantom that has brought Fayum to its knees. What could you want with him? 
to kill him. Belongs to a group that is destroying Egypt. I intend to hunt every last one of them down. Bayek of Siwa, you don't know what you are up against. The crocodile has transformed not only the land but the people. Those who do not cower in fear are made to work for him. And you have no idea who the crocodile is. I stole a ledger from a Greek magistrate I suspect of corruption. Mm. It should reveal the identity of this crocodile. And if we get it to Apollodorus, we may be able to bring down the whole organization. Where's the ledger now? I gave it to my wife Henu to hide. As long as the Ptolemies think it's with me, my family is safe. That is why I have to stay on the move. Here. This will tell Henu you are a friend to be trusted. It is for my daughter, Shadia. Once you're the ledger, find me at the docks south of Uhemeria. Uh, I've always noticed this in games, right? So when you get given something... Take a look around my ship before you go. Ah, yeah, there's a bunch of like... of local problems which may have the crocodile at the root. Yeah, there's a bunch of problems that people have got. Yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna bother. Um... People have disappeared in the Senhari. And then there's another one, he's... I think he's investigating a poison. Yeah, there you go, the sickness. Of people have disappeared in the yeah, I'm not bothered though. Um, we'll deal with that later, because we can't really do them at the moment anyway. Uh, so I need to get two... Ah, look, we're still on it, that's fine. So, oh, fucking hell. Um... Demons? Where's my ship? I have never seen one. Whee! I should check this out. Yeah, there's no point doing that because I'm way too under leveled. Even with my jump uh, and my gap that I managed to do, uh, way too under leveled. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers. Thanks for thanks for your boat. Cheers. Yeah. Just just sit back and enjoy the ride. Okay. I remember this place. I like this place. Um, there's a there's a there's a priest in here who's a bit of a dick, basically. Like he's a bit of a dick. He's not just a bit of a dick. He is a dick. Um, but yeah, this is. I, I'm just happy to be back. I'm just happy to be back playing it. It won't seem like much of a jump. Whoops, a daisy. Watch this. Watch this. I turn around. Ooh, get too far away. Oh, I think he's coming towards me. Here we go. Watch this. Watch. 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 Look at that! Down and out. Love it! Alright, there was also uh, some loot over here as well. I think. Oh, it's over there. Oh god, such sharp turns. Bolt went mid to do this. Right. Need a bit of loot. There we go. Whoa, another crocodile. Look at that. I love this ball, mate. This ball is awesome. Absolutely great. Some loot. Hard leather so hard to come by. Excuse the pun. Hard leather so hard to come by. Full of puns today. Right, so we're off to find someone's wife. Bayek finds a lot of people's wives. I think that's a bit. I think that's a bit suspicious, really. Oh, cool. Look at the moon in the left hand side. It's all red and glowy and stuff. That's awesome. It'd be a blood moon then, won't it? Mm. Probably will be. And the sun's just rising on that side. I've said, th I've said this before and I'll say it again. Like, hat off to the developers of this game. They did an amazing job. And we're in. F I don't know what that is either. Ah, here we go. And we're in. You heavy. You you. Oh fuck. You you hem. Mir Emria. Oh god, I can't pronounce it. We're in a new land, basically. Um. Right. So we're gonna go find his wife. And we're not gonna bang her at all. But that's not what Bayek does. Shut up. Oh, jumped on the table. Okay. 
So, we are... So, we've done a camp, and we've met our new ally, and we're about to meet his wife. So, hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, and I will catch you guys in the next episode. So, bye for now. Thank <music> you.